Hello everyone, my name is Antoine and welcome to another video on the channel and today we're going to continue to restore our Apple Watch Series 3 Nike with the release of the new update for the MFC software which is a very big update, we are going to talk about it and uh, this video will be a, a very short video, uh, I'm just going to talk about the new update and I'm going to uh, leave all the um, link for the program and the update down in the description and we are going to restore our Apple Watch Series 3 Nike uh, because in the previous video I said that uh, we have an error and a lot of uh, lots of errors uh, including for the uh, Series 3 Nike version and also the Apple Watch Series 1 and Series 2 with the IBEC problem and the IBSS problem so now that we are going to jump to the computer and to talk about the new update and continue restoring the watch so let's go okay now we connected the watch and as you can see it is in the recovery mode and as in the previous video we need the ibus which is in our case the ibus series 2 because we have the series 3 apple watch and of course the imfc dongle without it you will not have the imfc tab accessible in the software now if you have this problem uh, you need to uh, remove all the cache file from the extracting of the firmware in the file location itself to avoid the IBEC error. And now we are going to choose the uh, our IPS table, which is in our case the Series 3 GPS 42 millimeters. And uh, I would like to mention also about this update. This update contains the FDR data fix, which can be happening in the engine of the restore. I faced that problem with my Series 2 now but in the beta 3 the problem has been solved and of course the IBSS in bio problem which uh, we had in our previous video and I guess all we wanted is an update for the software now all the beta version will be updated daily until the final release and all the links will be in the description down below and of course the IPSW can check my previous video to download them for free and I will also put the link uh, down in the description for the video and now we are going to speed forward the process and I will meet you after the restore is done. But let me just put the Apple Watch on the screen. Here we go, just so you can see the uh, progress bar on the software and also on the watch. And now let's speed forward. Okay, now that the Apple Watch has been successfully restored, we are now going to disconnect the Apple Watch, but we are not going to uh, pair it or um, activate it with an iPhone because that will make this video very long and this is a very short update. But uh, before we finish this video, I would like to show you the official form for the MFC team on the GSM hosting page. I will also put uh, this page link down in the description down below so you can check it out and uh, if you have any uh, questions you can put it in the comment section down below i will try to respond it as fast as possible and i guess that's it for this video thanks for watching if the video was helpful please make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for additional content in the future and as always stay safe and have a good day